Hi, I'm Anthony Ramacone. I'm a rising junior at Harvard, and I am working at No Labels. No Labels is a kind of a grassroots nonprofit organization that's aiming to make government work by making compromise possible again. Because a lot of legislators in D.C. have kind of lost trust from both sides, uh, from Republicans to Democrats. Uh, there's a huge gulf, and nobody's getting anything done. So No Labels is working to make it possible for for government to start working again. I mostly focus on legislative research, so um, I, for instance, will do things like uh, look at the bills that some of our uh, members have co-sponsored or sponsored to see what some of their priorities are to see how we can work better with them. I had the pleasure of working with Mark McKinnon in the fall when he was a fellow at the IOP, and I'd kind of heard of No Labels before, but he really kind of got me much more interested in No Labels. and. Our entire study group was on disruptive movements within government, so I got really interested in things like campaign finance reform or electoral reform, as well as uh, no labels, roots record, all those kinds of groups. And uh, when I saw this on the director's interns uh, list, it really stuck out to me. I was really excited to come out here and do something where I knew that I wasn't going to be sitting behind a desk kind of doing menial tasks all day. I knew that it was going to be very involved once I got here. I try to get down to the mall and see all the different things I can. I had Ethiopian food the first time another day, or the other day. So there have been a lot of great moments. I think the coolest was we got to, uh, or I had the opportunity to go down to one of our problem solver meetings. So all of our representatives and senators who work with No Labels um, come together and we uh, meet every couple weeks or month or so, and uh, just bring in. They bring in experts and they discuss different policy issues, and it's just a really interesting time because. Uh, generally, Republicans and Democrats don't have meetings together outside of maybe a committee meeting or something like that. So to see all those people in action, and and they obviously knew that they were in a, uh, they were much more comfortable because they were in a, a zone where they knew they weren't going to get quoted or anything like that. So uh, to hear what they earnestly thought was really, really cool.